Hi students, welcome to Krabai Tuition Center. To find heights and distances, we need angle of elevation and angle of depression. So the instrument used to find this is called a theodolite. A theodolite is an instrument which is used in measuring the angle between an object and the eye of the observer. Now in the description box, I have given you the link where they have wonderfully explained you the three-dimensional view of a theodolite. Please have a glance at it. The most commonly used device to find the angle of elevation and the angle of depression is the clinometer. Following is the description of how to make and use a clinometer. Interested students can choose to make a clinometer for Max Mini project. This activity help us to learn how to measure the height of an object which will be difficult to measure otherwise. Now let us see how to make a clinometer. Tie one end of a string to the middle of a straw and the other end of the string to a paper clip. Glue the straw to the base of a protractor so that the middle of the straw aligns with the center of the protractor. Make sure that the string hangs freely to create a vertical line or the plumb line. Find an object outside that is too tall to measure directly such as a basketball hoop, a flagpole or the school building. Look at the top of the object through the straw. Find the angle where the string and the protractor intersect. Determine the angle of elevation by subtracting this measurement from 90 degrees. Let it be theta. Measure the distance from your eye level to the ground and from your foot to the base of the object that you are measuring. Say why. Make a sketch of your measurements. To find the height h of the object, use the following equation. h is equal to x plus y tan theta, where x represents the distance from your eye level to the ground. I hope this video helps you how to make a clinometer and use it to find the angle of elevation and angle of depression. Thanks for watching.